Hey guys, it's Allie and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be doing an unboxing and it is an unboxing for my brand new figure skating blades. I am so, so excited. So if you are interested in watching this video, please continue watching. I have been thinking about getting new blades for a while now, ever since I got my new skates. I got the Rydell Diamond Skates back in February, and they have just been absolutely amazing. I love them, but I did get the standard blade with them. The blades, again, they're the Capri blades. They are the stock blades that you pretty much get with any of their, you know, figure skating sets. Um, they have been great. But now that I'm doing spins and jumps, I've been in the market for a new set of blades. So I am a part of the Adult Skate 2 group on Facebook. Their group is absolutely amazing. If you have any questions, people are so knowledgeable on there and we all kind of help each other on there. So I went on and I asked what were good blades to get. And I got so many responses back saying that the John Wilson Correlation Ace Blades were amazing. So I decided to listen to all my fellow Adult Skate 2 friends and I got the John Wilson blades. I already kind of opened the box that they came in. Um, I ordered these off of figureskatingstore.com. I'll make sure to link them down below. Uh, the only reason why I ordered them from there is that they were cheaper than any of the other stores I was looking at. Someone had told me to get them off of Skates USA and I was going to get them off of there but the only thing is they were charging I believe $20 for shipping so that was a little pricey so I went on the figureskatingstore.com and I got free shipping like free standard shipping and it pretty much came in maybe two days so I'm very very lucky. This is the box for the blades itself. Very cutely packaged. And then on here, it just says Coronation Ace blades. And then it's, my blade length is 9.75. So they're nine and three eighths, I believe. Um, so yeah, let's open these up. I'm so excited I haven't opened them yet. Here they are. They're kind of just, they're wrapped in this like baker's sheet paper. Oh my God, they are beautiful. Of course, I get super excited about blades, but they look awesome. Wow, that toe pick looks gnarly. So I believe the toe, this toe pick is the cross cut, but that's going to be definitely different to my regular toe pick. I have my skate here next to me so I can show you guys kind of what's the difference between the two. So here are the blades up close. So I don't know if that you can see that. They're the cross cut. Then they say coronation, coronation ace right there. And then the John Wilson signature back here. Very, very pretty. I'm hoping that when my rink opens up, they'll be able to mount the blades for me. I know that they do do it. I just hope that I could be patient enough to actually get them to do it instead of me trying to do it myself. Um, Cause I don't want to mess it up. Cause I know that like the slightest inconsistency could really cause major issues. Um, but yeah, so let me grab my skate and we will compare between the two blades. So here is my beautiful uh, Rydell Diamond Skate. So there it is. So I am a size, I believe I'm a size five and a half, I think. Either a five, a five or a five and a half. I don't really, I don't remember. Like I said, my blade is nine and three fourths. So there is the blade up close and personal. I don't know why it's all scratched up. I guess maybe because of my rockers but they are stainless steel and they are the Capri blades by Rydell. Like I said, they're the stock blades that come with the skate. 
My skates are actually super, super sharp because I got them sharpened last week, I believe. So they are really sharp, so I have to be careful. There are the two blades side by side. It's kind of hard to tell. So yeah, it looks like a perfect match. So that was the only thing that I was really nervous about buying them online is that I really didn't want to order the wrong size because that would have been tragic, but they seem to be perfect. Um, so looking at the toe picks, there is the difference in the toe pick. So as you can tell, this isn't cross cut. This is just, you know, just the standard basic toe pick that comes with any figure skate or any entry level figure skate. And, you know, compared the two, this one's the crisscross uh, style. It's kind of hard to tell. Straight cut toe picks allow skaters to dig into the ice deep, increase height, but they'll sometimes lose momentum. Whereas cross cut picks don't dig in as deeply, but will grip the ice better with less sliding. Capri blades are beginner blades with a 5 8 radius of hollow. CAs are intermediate to advanced. John Wilson's website said they are used in the Olympics. And they have a 7 16 ROH or radius of hollow. They are both parallel blade styles and they both have 7 foot rockers. I'm so excited to try these out. It's going to be really weird at first. I've heard that it could take you like 3 weeks to actually get used to new blades. So I'm excited to start that um, that journey because it's going to be scary. <laughs> Hopefully I can record myself, you know, the first time on the ice with my new blades. But yeah, so that is that. I'm sorry that I can't provide too much information about the blades and stuff. I'll make sure to link um, all the links down below. It's mostly um, your preference and your skate style. That all really depends on what kind of blades that you want to go for. Again, a lot of the girls did recommend these blades because um, I was kind of in between these and the, um, the MK Professionals. So I was looking at the MK Professionals or one of the Rydell brand I think there were the Auroras, I want to say. Um, but a lot of people were saying definitely go with the Correlation Ace. Coronation Ace blades that they're actually absolutely fantastic. So I'm super, super excited. Um, I didn't realize there's like oil on the blades and I'm like rubbing the oil all over the blades. So I should probably not do that. Thank you so much for watching this video. I know that again, it's not super informative, but I was just excited to show you guys the new blades that I got. Uh, again, I will link everything down below. So if you have any questions about where to get the blades or, you know, anything like that, they will be linked down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all on the next one. Bye.